Our first opening today, as seen live, twitch.tv slash the game capital. The only place to see all of our openings. The only place to see them all happen live. It's a lot more fun that way, trust me. It's a lot more fun. So if you're not already following us on twitch.tv slash the game capital, you should definitely join us on there. So uh dive on over there. Wherever you're seeing this in the future, pause. The link should be down below. Twitch.tv slash the game capital. Go. Go and follow us on there. Uh, we stream Yu-Gi-Oh! openings on Thursdays. Yu-Gi-Oh! and Card Fight is, like, featured for Thursdays. And we stream Pokemon four times a week. Um, you guys can buy the product from us on our website. The stuff labeled as Breaks. And uh, I'll open it live on stream for you. For Pokemon, you get the stuff at a discounted rate. And then you, I open the stuff, you get all the shiny stuff. So you buy a booster box of Darkness Ablaze, for instance. Uh, well, we are pre-selling these for, like... We're pre-selling for the equivalent of less than $2 a pack. Yeah. We're, we're pre-selling booster case breaks at $3.80, which is $63 and change a box. The single box would be a little higher because we got to come for shipping, but if you buy a box break of this from us, you'll get all the shiny stuff. Reverses and better. Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! We haven't figured out a great way to do breaks yet. It's just basically you buy a box, and then we open it and send it to you. Um, certain things we have on the website, like Dual Overload, there's an option to buy it where you get just the higher end stuff. But, yeah. Uh, I don't want to ramble too much. We want to start cracking this. And, uh, Lost Art promos as well. Uh, if they're in hand when they happen, uh, they're one per person. So, uh, potatoes are tasty. You will get a Harpy Conductor with your order as well. And, uh, let's, let's cut into this here. Let's cut into this here. Date, June 27th, shift A. Job number 58332, inspected by... And there's a stamp up higher there. It was inspected by somebody. It was inspected. Who's the Yu-Gi-Oh card inspector? And there's what it looks like on the inside. Let's see. I'm going to try to like get these all out. So it should be three deep. That's the... That's one corner. That's a corner. That's a corner. And that's a corner. Now we're going to find out how how fast or how slow Jeff can open a booster case of Yu-Gi-Oh, I guess. And it's already been almost three minutes, so... Let's see. I'm going to go, like, all the way across here so I got some space to operate. But they're all in view, so that's good. So let's go... Uh, Tails, if you want to stay on the top layer or whatever, we can do whatever, but I'm going to go here, work our way down, probably, and work our way across. Alright. Potatoes are tasty. Best of luck to you, my friend. And may the pulls and the starlight rares be ever in your favor. I should probably actually dump this garbage out right away so, uh, packs don't end up flying everywhere. We go through a lot of pack wrappers around these here parts. And as you can see, based on the queue, we should be opening 19 boxes of these today. Plus a... Where did I set now? Plus a movie pack secret edition display box. Aw, uh, no box toppers. Ooh, multiple pack arts for this set. I guess we'll uh, toss this up here. Actually, I just go like this. I always like to put them upside down because the packs feel backwards to me otherwise. Alright. Figure out my layout as we go here, I guess. So there's only two rarities. I need... So let's see. I want to try at least leave what's like over $10. So number C1, Numeron Calling, Fossil Warrior Skull Knight, Numeron Network, Invocation, and Chaos Emperor the Dragon of Armageddon. And the Starlight Rares. I will try to sleeve as we go. If you see one, I don't sleeve it. Please yell at me. Just at me like, hey, you pull such such, you should sleeve it. And uh, I'll do so. So, secret rare on top. So, we'll do a pack trick of one. The one from the front will move to the back or something, I guess. So, Judgment the Dragon of Heaven. And uh, I'll say every card in the first few packs until we kind of start seeing some repeats. And then we'll get faster and faster as we go. Appliancer Laundry Dragon. Appliancer Socket Troll. Secure Gardna. And Appliancer Vaculophant. 
So three appliancers in that pack. <laughs> I don't know anything for these sets. Someone said 1k a card. And if you're watching this in the future, oh, there's one of the good ones. I didn't do the pack trick. Uh, maybe we don't need, need to bother. We'll just, we'll just jump to it if that's okay with you guys. If you don't like it, yell at me right now. But number C1, that's ten and a half dollars right now on TCG Player. Number C1. And we got Black Whirlwind, Appliancer Reuse, Numeron Wall. Was that one of the good ones? No, Numeron Calling and Numeron Network. Those are the ones over 10. And then Book of Moon. I remember that card. That's a throwback. That's a throwback. Yep. Uh, each pack, you get four Ultra Rares and one Secret Rare. Powered Crawler Secret Rare. And are you guys good with the focus, or do you want me to adjust the focus a little bit? Where I can like, hold the cards up a little bit more, and they're not fuzzy. Uh, Obedience Schooled. Appliancer Copy Buckle. Buckle? Galaxy Worm. Invoked Kaliga. Oops. Let's see. So yeah, five cards every pack. Entire set includes 59 Ultra Rares, four per pack, and 33 Secret Rares, one per pack. Plus there's two Starlights. There's also that. Number C92, Heart Earth Chaos Dragon. Formud Skipper. Appliancer Electrical World. Boost Warrior. And number four, Numeron Gate Katvari. 55 inch TV. <laughs> Glacial Beast Iceberg Narwhal. That's a narwhal? I guess. I guess so. There, there's a horn on this part. Narwhals, narwhals. Elemental Hero Neos Elias. Intruder Alarm Yellow Alert. Flower Cardian Cherry Blossom. Not Guardian, Cardian. And Afterglow. Ten thousand copies still sounds like a lot, but I don't know. Fossil Dragon Skulgios. Number one. That's C one. That's good. Okay. Salmon Great Gazelle. Secure Gardener, Ra's Disciple, the Winged Dragon of Ra. Fossil Warrior Skull Cane. Yep. Oh, wait, no. Fossil Warrior Skull Knight is $14. This one is le less than 10. <laughs> Assault Blackwing Sahaya. The Rainstorm. Malefic Paradigm Dragon. Mecha Phantom Beast O Lion. And Junk Anchor. Darkness Metal. The Dragon of Dark Steel. That card looks sick. I don't know if it's any good. That card looks really awesome. O Lion's great. Psychic Wave, Invoked Ragin, Fire Flint Lady, Appliancer, Celtipus. More the jump reprints? Sweet. Yeah, that thing looks amazing. Trishula, the Dragon of Icy Imprisonment. I've seen Trishula cards before. Elemental Hero, Chaos Neos, Appliancer, Sakatrol. Number two, and appliance or test. Yeah, this is this is one box. We're on the first box. Glacial beast, polar penguin. There's a pangi. There's a pangi. Goyo defender, artifact sanctum. That card's good or something still. Oh, yeah, that one's about five bucks. That's on page one. 516 right now. Invoked Purgatrio. I recognize that card as well. 
and Penguin Torpedo. The Jump Dragons are short print, and we just got two of them. Nice. Whoa, DJ No Lid. How many was that? DJ No Lid dropping 10 gift subs. Cryptic Vulpix, Arc Heaven, Not Jinx, Whiskey Jack, Metal Master, Vader Fu, Phoenix Death, Just Devo, and Steinbrenner's Army are now all subscribed. And Aichi Boy. <laughs> DJ No Lid, thank you, my friend. Thank you, thank you. 10 gift subs going off. And again, if you're watching this in the future, not live, you could have seen it live on twitch.tv slash the game capital. The Elvis Developer plays live. And uh, it's more fun because there's gift subs and craziness and just just good stuff. And DJ Nolid, DJ Nolid is a madman. Um, I should probably read the card name still too. Uh, Glacial Beast, Blizzard Wolf, Valerifon, Mystical Beast of the Forest. Invoked Elysium, Galaxy Worm, and Appliancer Breaker Bunkle. And Zero Minimax with 100 bits as well. If one more person does 100 bits or more, or subs or gift subs, we will start a hype. And there it is. Eugene Echo dropping 100 bits. Hype? Question mark? Yes, indeed. The hype train is on. Artifact Ignition. It's a good car named at the start here of a hype train. And we are nearly done with level 3 right away, thanks to DJ Nolid dropping those 10 gift subs. We're at 86% on level 3. We're super all in right now. Super all in. Potatoes is super all in, that's for sure. Salmon Great Gazelle, Junk Anchor, and Topologic Zero Boros. And last pack of the first half of this box. Yes, everyone who is newly subbed now, enjoy your lovely new emotes. The Angry Jigglypuff, the Confused Psyduck, the Golden Hands, Pops the Penguin, our store mascot, and Milo Secret with my cat's face. The Great One with the 100 biddies. Thank you, thank you. Uh, specimen Inspection, Darkfire Girl, Cookie Cookie, 100 bits. Necros of Gun... Gun... Gunnear. Something. Words are hard. Super all in. First duplicate, I think. Koaki Miru Drago. Is that a blue eyes? And Appliancer Vacu Elephant. Vacu Time stream. Uh, we stream at 2 p.m. Central most days. We do Pokemon. Uh, but Yu-Gi-Oh! is usually around 4 p.m. Central, if that's what the card's asking me, of course. Next level with 105 bits. Trying to get that conductor badge, I see. I see you. I see you. I'll uh, be doing Drool Monsters opening. <laughs> drool Monsters? Drool Monsters. And uh, level 3 of the Hype Train has been defeated. Number 1. Obedient Schooled. Appliancer Dryer Drake. And Elemental Hero Shining Flare Women. These appliancers are nutty. These appliancers are nutty. Fossil Warrior Skull Kane. We want Knight. We want the Knight, not the King. It's the second one of those. It's our first secret rare duplicate. Appliancer Kappa Scale. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Lion Emperor. Number four. Numeron Gate Katvari. Brett Favre. And Invoked Burger Trio. <clears throat> Level three crushed. I'm never late. Dark Spell Regeneration. Malefic Paradigm Dragon. Appliancer Laundry Dragon. Black Wayne Chris the Crack of Dawn. And Appliancer Test. I think I'll just do every card of this first box. And then we'll, we'll you know, name the secret rare most of the time. And just kind of skim through the ultras for the most part. Because all the highest price cards. <laughs> all the highest price cards are uh, secret rares. The highest ultra rare is Artifact Sanctum at about five bucks. So while there's there's still plenty of value in the ultra rares as well, uh, there's no home runs in the ultra rares. Fossil Dragon Skullgar, Elemental Hero Chaos Neos, and Eugene with the six bits to uh, surpass next level's 105. 
Number three, Numeron Gate Trini, Elemental Hero, Shining Flare, Wayman. And number two, Numeron Gate DVE. Lots of numbers in that one. I'm just pulling out and sleeving the cards over $10 because otherwise it's hard to know where to draw the line and how to keep track of what's all valuable without slowing things down tremendously. But these are all for Potatoes Are Tasty. Potatoes Are Tasty. High Rate Draw. Four Mud Skipper. Appliancer Electric World. Cross Sheep. There's our first Cross Sheep. And Flower Cardian Cherry Blossom. So this first box will take us about 15 minutes, then we'll probably be under 10 minutes of box thereafter. Armored White Bear. Goyo Defender. Appliancer Reuse. Fire Flint Lady. Appliancer Breaker Buncle. Elemental Hero. Eskuridao. That thing that's got a hard name. Number three. Afterglow. Appliancer Celtipus. Numeron Network! That, I think, is one of the ones we're looking for. I was on the wrong page now. Or am I lying? The Great One with seven bits! We, we've got quite the war here for the for the hype train boss. Uh, conductor from the bit side. So yes, Numeron Network, that is $18 right now. That is the third most expensive card in the set. Numeron Network. Sean the Collector with the 8 bits. I don't think you did 100 bits already, though. Uh, you have to do at least 100 bits or sub or gift sub during the hype train to get a hype train uh, emote if you don't already have all the ones from that level and below. And Darkfire Girl with another 100 bits. That makes Darkfire Girl the current conductor. Um, so DJ Nolid is conducted with 10 subs and Darkfire Girl with 200 bits. And there are 40 seconds left on the hype train unless we level up again. Uh, oh, I got these cards here still, too. Oh, my God. Dragon Buster Destruction Sword. Invoked Elysium. Kalantosa, Mystical Beast of the Forest. And number S39, Utopia, the Lightning. We're looking for uh, number 39, Utopia, as a Starlight Rare. Anonymous with nine bits. That's that's not going to help you with with any anything there. But thank you for the nine bits. <laughs> Madolchi and Jelly. Zero Magnum. Oh, God. 200 bits. Let's up the ante. Eugene, 100 bits. 2-1. And there's the buzzer. <laughs> and Darkfire Girl, did you get the 100 in? Who got Who got Conductor? Oh, my gosh. Who got the Conductor badge? <laughs> Looks like Zero got the Conductor badge. 10 subs, 935 bits. Um... I'm making a note of the bits there. Making a note of the bits. And subs. We're at 291 now. That offset all the ones that expired overnight and then some so far. Us and now as a reminder, we can't start a hype train again for an hour, so nobody try to start any hype trains until after 6 p.m. Central. Assault Black Wayne. Sahoya of the Rainstorm. Steam Synchron. Appliancer, Dryer, Drake, and Salmon Great. Sunlight Wolf is back as well. See a day where Jeff is getting so many donos, the pack opening grinds to a halt. It happens all the time. Numeron Calling. That one is the other one, right? Uh, yes. Eleven and a half dollars on Numeron Calling. So we got three of the money cards. Sean the Collector, thank you for the follow. Are, are you... Are you the employee, Sean? Or are you a different Sean? Psychic Wave. Necros of Gunir. Koaki Miru Drago. And Ra's Disciple. Last pack of the first of 12 booster boxes of this booster case. Danger! Jackalope. I was thinking it was an ultra rare. I didn't realize it was a secret I'm surprised that one's under $2 right now. That's probably going to go up. 
Different Sean, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Appliancer, Kappa Scale. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist. Go you, Guardian. And Penguin Torpedo. Um. So I'm just going to line these up, the Ultra Rares, in an open booster box as we go. And the rest I can keep on here, though. So the first box, your highlights based on value are these three right here. Did I say go you? My bad. My bad. All right. Box number two. And now we'll stop naming all the ultra rares. I don't know if we've seen all of them yet, but... We'll see how it plays out. From this booster case. Which, it is a factory... Well, it was a factory seal booster case. All these boxes came from one case. Can confirm. Can confirm. These boxes I got a frisbee toss instead of Kobe. Want to see some fire? Numeron Network in the first pack. That's a good start to this box. Another network. I'm going to try change the focus because I, I want to get the cards a little bit closer because I'm paging through and not seeing the names especially. I want you guys to be able to see okay what they are. Uh, Sean the Collector, once we opened the storefront over three years ago, I had no time for YouTube. So, I, I, I can't keep up with one channel right now anyway. Basically. Let's try that. So, I'll make the cards on the mat out of focus. So, you'll be able to see what I'm opening better. Another number C1. So, I can hold a little... Let's see. I... Well, the, I won't stay like this forever, but... Number C1. I don't remember that card. Yeah, there's still some ultras we haven't seen yet. I think. Just like or comment on Jeff's most recent YouTube video. Weathering Soldier. Go yo! Book of Moon. Yeah, I zoomed a little bit too much. I gotta hold the cards too high now. We'll find that sweet spot. There's another darkness metal, the Dragon of Dark Steel. That thing just looks awesome. That's a pretty, pretty card. Dragon Buster Destruction Sword. I think Numeron Wall might be worth a few bucks, too. Dark Armed, the Dragon of Annihilation. That thing also looks amazing. Appliancer, number three. Salmon Great, Sunlight Wolf. Glacial Beast, Polar Penguin. Number one. DJ Nola is number one on the gift sub leaderboard. It's got that lovely little orange gift box. Armored white bear. What kind of bear is best? Quit back on Pokemon cards for seven was still an active channel. That's a while ago. Because Pokemon cards for seven became the Poke Capital. And then once you open the storefront, we just moved everything into the game capital, ultimately. Artifact Ignition. But yeah, Sean the Collector. One of our employees' name is Sean, spelled the same way, so I was like, well, maybe, maybe that's him? Maybe? Bears. Beats. Fossil Fusion. That one's five bucks. 508. 
tenth most expensive card in the set. Just behind Artifact Sanctum. Not as short as some thought it was. Weathering Soldier. Cross Sheep again. Reminds me of a code name, Kids Next Door Show. I remember that. Danger Jackalope. Number one. So many appliancer cards. Dub Bears. Well, Thursday is Yu-Gi-Oh! Day, first and foremost, Nano. Time stream, uh, 2 p.m. Central, most days, is when we go live. Thanks for asking. Thanks for asking. Fossil Warrior Skullbone? How many Fossil Warriors are there? We need the Knight. Salmon Great. Go-Yo. Getting a lot of Go-Yos. Well, it should be at most once per box, right, Zero? I gotta keep reminding people that are watching this in the future on YouTube that we're also live a lot of the time on twitch.tv slash thegamecapital. If they don't already watch us there, they definitely, definitely should by pausing their video right now and going over and following us. Where we do Yu-Gi-Oh! and Card Fight on Thursdays and Pokemon four days a week that aren't Thursday. Elemental Hero. Escuradao. A lot of these just look really cool. Looks kind of like one of those uh, bad guys on Team NT back in the... Not back in the day, but... Anyways. Anyways. Knight is like two per case. I believe it. Another Jackalope. Okay, so that's our third Jackalope. Two in this box. So maybe it will stay under... Uh... We'll see. Okay, now you can see better. Glacial Beast, Iceberg, Narwhal. So right here, you can see it's got the Narwhal horn and stuff. So that's an interesting creature. An Aqua Synchro. Narwhal, Narwhal, swimming in the ocean. Appliancer, Obedience, number four, Galaxy Worm. Escarado. Colorado? Number C92, Heart Earth Chaos Dragon. There's some nice art on some of these cards, for sure. <laughs> As El Ichi says, the Yu-Gi-Oh! designs are so nice. Nicely timed. Nicely timed. High rate draw. Madolce and Jelly. Number one. Secure Gardner. And this card is from Evolutions for Pokemon because it has a print line. It's got a print line right around here. Hard to show on camera, but for those that have been seeing our Evolutions openings for Pokemon, you guys know all about the print lines. Some of these have them too. Ask Weirdo. Another Fossil Fusion. So, yeah, can't be too short printed. Can't be too short printed. Second one in this box. So, for a $5 card, it's a good card. <laughs> it must be a really good card if it's holding 5 bucks and you can get more than one in a box. I would think. Fossil Dragon Skullgios. Artifact Sanctum. I guess I didn't see that last time. I want to find it now. It's the $5 Ultra Rare. It's a trap. There are not a lot of traps in this set. Did I sleeve it? I 
Did I put in the wrong pile? Cross sheep. Uh, did I put in the secret pile by mistake? Where did it go? Oh, duh, Jeff. You put the first box of ultra rares off to the side already. I was only looking at ultra rares from the same box. You get a lot of ultra rares in the box, let me tell you. So I think it's the only ultra that's trapped then. Do, 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 do. There we go. Artifact Sanctum. I can see the trap in the sleep pile to the right. There's no sleep pile to the right. Last pack of the second box. Fossil Dragon Skullgar. Goyo Defender. Oh, there's more than one different Goyo. Another Invoked Purgatrio. So those boxes were very similar. Uh, well, we got calling in the first box, not the second box. So two of the $10 cards we got in both boxes so far. Curious to see how that plays out. Box three. Poor K? Poor K what? Yamo is Jigglypuff. No, it's not. You're a liar. You gotta lie to us like that. Oh, I got caught up my thumb. Hi for life. Got some more. If you can drop that off in on. In the office here, when you have a chance, that'd be cool. Another Skull Cane. Why is Skull Cane worth more than Skull Knight? That seems weird. Like, I don't, I don't know what they do. But shouldn't Cane be better than Knight? Another Darkness Metal, the Dragon of Dark Steel. We've gotten that in every box so far. So that one shouldn't be short printed? I understand you're just... I feel like Kane should be the best one. And it should be the short printed one as well then. If they're going to short print at all. Artifact Sanctum. Let's see. What have we not seen yet? We have not yet seen Fossil Warrior Skull Knight. We have not seen Invocation. We have not seen Chaos Emperor the Dragon of Armageddon. That's what we want to see. And it seems like we always get those, the two dragons, in back-to-back -back packs as well. Interestingly enough. Glacial Beast, Polar Penguin. Now let's see if the bear is next. I feel like I've gotten Penguin and then bear back-to-back -back in each box so far, too. Seen some weird patterns emerging here. So is there a bear in this pack? As the secret rare. Close-ish, but no. Glacial Beast, Blizzard Wolf. Maybe I'm not onto something. Well, with Yu-Gi-Oh card zero, you, you never really know for sure. Specimen inspection. Book of Moon. Fossil Warrior Skullbone. Okay, so there's two trap cards that are uh, ultra rares. Fossil Fusion. Salmon Great Sunlight Wolf. Uh, let me remind myself what's in the second page here. What else is really good? Okay, so the Mecha Phantom Beast O line that we got, maybe only one of so far, is about four bucks. Numeron will always see a few times. It's down to like three. The Trishula is about four. Darkness Metal is about five. That's been going up. Only 14 listings. 
So, either it's short, and we've been really lucky early here. Thank you. Um, or... I don't know. Medulci and Jelly is three and a half. High rate draw, buck and a half. Number F0? I don't think we got that one yet. That one's three bucks. Utopia the Lightning, two, two... Yeah, the current prices and market prices aren't super in line, so, like, it's not super in order on TCG right now. But, yeah, it's definitely kind of wonky. PS Emperor is super shorted by comparison and is the chase card. Yeah, I, I know. They are, and we have been lucky. Huh. Fossil Warrior! Skull Knight! He does exist. Skull Knight. Uh, the Invocation and the Chaos Emperor Dragon. I'll probably put those in top loaders right away, too. I can put more in top loaders. I'm just trying to not take too long. Power Crawler. There's number F0 for the first time as well. I just said that was what? That's about $3 right now. Appliancer, 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 number four. All the Appliancers. Elemental Hero, however you want to say it. <laughs> It's also got like 10,000 down there and my hands got sweaty. Is this fan on? Oh dear God. There it is folks. 10,000 dragon, $1,444.95 is the current cheapest on TCG player. This is the most expensive card I think I've ever held on stream so far. And it looks good, too. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Holy poop. I do my best to not, like, react until I got a top loader, because I want to spit on the card or anything. Oh. Well, Zero, our stuff came from, like, five different cases, so... Who knows? Who knows? But, uh, Potatoes Are Tasty is now playing with the house's money. <laughs> Box break over. <laughs> Holy cow. It's Utopic. Thank you for the host. Oh, my God. 
How you doing, potatoes? How you doing? <laughs> oh my god. Thank you, next level. Ooh. That's a card. That right there is a card, folks. Helpless Lively Sushi DX A Bomb. That's that's the URL. And by the way, the uh, the code thing or whatever these are, it's zero 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 one zero 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 zero, aka ten thousand. Even the edges are shiny. Potatoes, are are you passed out? Are you okay? Because you mentioned driving. You didn't drive off the road, did you? Oh. Where do we go from here? Abri, abri, abri. That's all, folks. And a number S390 Topia Lightning. Oh my god. Numerot, this is a god box. So we already got these in the box too. Our first Skull Knight and another network. Time for Pokemon. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh my god. Madolchi and Jelly, there's another $3 and change. You know, pad things a little bit more. Whew. Numeron Calling! Yep, that, that's a good one. <laughs> You're getting a lot of hits in this box. And you don't need any hits in this box. I think, well, that's maybe the first of this box. Fourth Jackalope overall. Artifact Ignition. Judgment, the Dragon of Heaven. Numeron Wall. It's another few bucks. Number C1. Why not? If you get like Chaos Emperor Dragon in this box too, that'd just be nutty. Or an invocation. <laughs> Powered Crawler. That's what I was scared of. Don't do that. I'm just doing my job. And the last pack of this god box. Glacial Beast Iceberg Narwhal. Oops, got a few more cards hiding. But uh, yeah, that box contained number C1. Numeron Calling, Numeron Network, Fossil Warrior Skull Knight, and by the way, 10,000 Dragon. 10,000 Dragon. Now we've got nine boxes left, but uh, the rest will be anticlimactic, so I think I'll end the YouTube video here at least. Um, so if you watch this in the future on YouTube or somewhere else, maybe Facebook, who knows where this could end up. Uh, make sure you click it over to twitch.tv slash gamecapital where you can see this kind of insanity happen live. It's even more fun that way. Uh, if we ever open all these right away, we might do a case recap or something, a separate video, but uh, th we pulled this. That, that's a good video on itself, I think. I think that's a pretty good video. So, yeah, but please do join us, twitch.tv slash gamecapital where you can find polls that are over 9,000. 10,000 dragon. 
currently worth $1,444.95. That's the cheapest listed right now on T-Sheet Player. Wow. Thanks for watching, YouTube.